the 52nd birthday celebration of slain civil rights leader Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. took on a festive holiday mood throughout Miami's black community. Several thousand people, young and old, joined the march along Northwest 62nd Street to commemorate the birth of Dr. King. The marchers chanted some of the songs heard during the civil rights demonstrations led by Dr. King in the early days of the civil rights struggle. The marchers wore black shirts and blouses as well as black armbands. Motorists drove with their headlights on. Many of the marchers were young school-aged children who apparently left classes to participate in the activities. When the marchers reached Manor Park, organizers said prayers and urged unity among blacks. If they ever ask you in Miami, what are you? You tell them we are one. What are we in Miami? We are one. About two miles away, a second march was underway. This one included several Miami City officials led by Mayor Maurice Ferre. During ceremonies at the Shell City site, Ferre read a proclamation proclaiming January 15th, Martin Luther King Jr. Day in Miami. I, as mayor of the city of Miami, who hereby proclaim today, Thursday, January the 15th, of the year 1981, as Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Day in Miami, <laughs> Several political figures taking part in the King celebration said they will join with the masses of black people in Miami, urging Congress to declare January 15th a national holiday. C.T. Taylor, Channel 4 News, Miami.